Schoology's gradebook is filled with great filters and shortcuts. But before you start using the gradebook, make sure that you have entered all the grading categories, weights, and your other preferences in grade setup. First off, the gradebook gives me great information about student activity in addition to their current grades. These icons tell me that students have made a submission. I've just not had time to grade it yet. In contrast to these students who haven't submitted anything at all. I can click the submission icon to be taken directly to the student's submission for scoring. And the scores I enter here when evaluating the work are automatically sent to the gradebook. But you may need to refresh the page as I did. You can also enter scores directly into the gradebook. I can override auto graded items like this quiz. And if I do so, this icon indicates a manual override, which I can also clear. If I hover in the left corner of a cell, I can flag an assignment as missing, incomplete, or excused. And to remove the flag, I click it off essentially. If I hover in the lower right of a cell, I can enter comments that I can elect for the students to see. All columns in the gradebook are hyperlinked directly to the assignment, quiz, or discussion, so I can click the title of a column to quickly jump to that item if I need to score several submissions at once. And if you want a quick view at a student's grade report, all you have to do is click this bar graph icon next to his or her name, and the student report will open in a new tab. In addition to viewing and entering grades, I can create additional gradebook columns or graded items with the Add button. The three dots at the top of each gradebook column give me some nice shortcuts also. I can use the Set All Grades function to fill a score all the way down the column, and then I can change individual cells as needed. The three dots also allow me to quickly mark all empty cells as excused, missing, or incomplete. Marking a cell missing also enters a value of zero for the cell. Tracking revisions enables you to see how a student's score has changed if you allowed for revisions or multiple submissions. And view statistics gives you specific data about student performance on the item. If you have many graded columns in your gradebook, there are a couple things you can do to cut down on scrolling and hunting for items. If you've created grading groups in your class, you can filter by those to reduce the number of students you are seeing at one time. And as a side note, if you use linked sections, there will be an additional menu to filter between the linked sections of your course, as shown in this English class. The toggle full screen option collapses the left menu to give you more screen real estate. And if you have set up grading categories in your grade setup, you can also filter by your categories, which makes it a lot easier to locate items because you have a shorter list to look through. Columns will be sorted in your gradebook by due dates, but you can adjust that here. And if you're not using due dates, columns sort themselves alphabetically. The view filter is another useful tool for highlighting student work that needs to be graded, hasn't been submitted, or a variety of other options. If you feel like an assignment is missing from your gradebook view, a good place to find it and to find out why it is not displaying is in bulk edit. You can access bulk edit by using the three dots here. Notice you can also export your gradebook as a CSV file or print student grade reports here. Bulk edit pulls up all of the assignments in my class. If an assignment is marked as ungraded or if it is missing a grading period, it will not display in my default gradebook view. From here, I can quickly locate assignments and fix any categories or grading period issues. Just don't forget to save your changes here. And finally, the course switcher is a great time saver for quickly switching to the gradebook of another one of your courses in the least amount of clicks possible. The Schoology gradebook allows you to quickly view and enter information about student activity and performance, and has flexible filters and features that allow you to most efficiently navigate your gradebook.